it looks like we are going to be seeing the Tilde Falco. Yeah. It's gone to a point where I sometimes accidentally call Falco Tilde, which is hilarious. <laughs> I got done it at least three times. I'm just like, oh yeah, Tilde. I'm like, wait, this is a different, it's a whole different player. <laughs> and we've seen, matchup, we've seen this matchup a billion times, typically in favor of Tilde. However, still has her own tricks that, you know, she's good at just banging out. But right now, it's not happening because Tilde is out here doing a bunch of, you know, possibly a zero to death kind of situation. Yeah, Dill hasn't, uh, Dill hasn't found any time for any sorts of tricks. Till is still at 0% right now, racking things yep. up, and that is a zero to death by Tilde on Dill. I, was, I want to compliment Tilde on actually avoiding a bunch of, you know, the Rob Nair and the Rob Laser that Dill tried throwing out um, earlier in the match when she was getting uh, comboed out. And, you know, the amazing spacing from his, on his part, amazing, you know, making sure that he knows when to get away from those kind of attacks. But now he's getting absolutely demolished by that gyro and the laser combo and the down tilt as well. But now here comes that side B into back air into nothing. Ooh, that is going to be a punish, the down air on shield. Yep. Ooh, but the high Falco Phantasm not going to be catching any arm murders at all. Oh. Still uh, taking her time right now, just holding down that gyro. Mm -hmm. Definitely taking her time, trying to be a little more patient in this matchup. Now she has to find her way back into center stage with no town and city platforms to help. That's a joy of, of town and city where it just changes through the, the three different platform I, uh, the platform um, scenarios. So now we have a regular battlefield type of platform situation where it would, would be very beneficial for Dill and even more so for Tilde when he's able to get those uh, those sideways into oh just barely missing. Tilde hit four lasers in a row. That just felt disrespectful. I'm not able to punish that forward air on shield until they is able to get Dill's second stock while still holding on to his own very comfortably. Now he has a two stock lead, 130% or 137%. Still just refusing to die and Dill trying her best to close out at least this first stock and maybe even take it take it back. Now we're kind of, you know, to a town city Omega stage, having no platforms for Dill to really rely on or Tilde. But Tilde is just fine with that kind of situation as we've seen earlier. Great spacing around uh, Dill uh, jumping from ledge with the gyro. Tilde jumped just over it and was able to punish Dill, putting her back off stage where it feels like this entire uh, game has taken place. Ooh, oh, pun. Down air caught the air dodge and no fuel. I Dill think Tilde should have psyched her out. Like, by hovering near the ledge and not allowing Dill to recover back on stage. Because had she gone up higher, it, she likely would have been punished with mm -hmm. a uh, Falco down air. And her only option was to hover and just run out of fuel. Yeah, and I mean... Yeah, Dill that's, or, that's I mean, foul. Yeah. <laughs> Tilda was threatening oh, but, with the down air. But then no one see Dill's face. Even she was like, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Running it right back to town and city, which I mean, yeah, you know, is still a good stage oh, for no. Rob, but I really feel like it benefited Falco much more than it benefited Rob in that game one. It definitely so. does. I think Dill just wants to run it back. Let's put some bubblegum KK on. <laughs> Ooh. All right, looking for some Z drop shenanigans. Dill actually the one to be put off stage by that interaction. All right, pressuring with the Nair, Dill able to fight, fight her way off. Uh, Tilda's use of Reflector so far has been great. Uh, really just been on top of Dill's uh, rhythms. Yeah, with making sure that Gyro does all... Oh, no. That's unfortunate, the air dodge and just... I'm surprised Dill wasn't able to make it back. I thought she still had her jump as well as the full tank of gas. I think maybe the lag of the air dodge was just yeah. a little bit too much. I think she was a little bit too low to come back. Or at the very least she wasn't she didn't know she maybe she didn't react in time, I'm not sure. It's really it's a really unfortunate way to take out someone to, to lose your stock. And here's there's another Ooh. fortunate way to lose your stock with <laughs> off the stage and totally again having a three a two stock lead on Dill. All right. And it just keeps coming with Tilde. Already just about lapping Dill in percent the second time now. Dill going all the way to the top. I think no gas left in the tank. All right, but the drag down fair up tilt into back air. A quick commanding 2-0 by Tilde. Yeah.
Absolutely I think that was devastating. that was two three stocks, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. That was rough. I think the first game he was also completely at three stocks the entire time, although it was you know struggling to fight her way mm -hmm. uh, to s take a stock. I heard break dance. I heard break dance. Yeah. Oh, I was <laughs> like, oh, we break dancing? Let's go! I can't do Yo, that. You're funny. It's Kirby Factory music.